Berberine is getting pretty popular because it not only lowers blood sugar and cholesterol levels, but also because it appears to also foster some weight loss as well. And it's even being compared to diabetes medications such as Ozempic. See my previous video on berberine versus Ozempic, but for today, let's talk about whether berberine has any side effects. So because berberine can lower blood sugar levels, it makes sense that it might interact with medications such as metformin, sulfonylurea medications, and yeah, even drugs like Ozempic and similar acting medications for diabetes. In theory, this interaction might also carry over to dietary supplements known for blood sugar lowering effects, such as cinnamon and chromium, black seeds, alpha-lipoic acid, and others. There's also speculation that berberine might increase levels of a variety of medications, including antidepressant drugs, epileptic medications, codeine, aspirin, and other NSAID medications, as well as even antihistamines and others. If you are pregnant or you're nursing, absolutely avoid berberine because there's not much research on these groups of individuals, and because of preliminary evidence that suggests that berberine might not be safe during pregnancy. Because berberine appears to have a blood pressure lowering effect, this means in theory it might also have an interaction with other supplements known to lower blood pressure. Examples of this would include things like hibiscus tea, melatonin, arginine, and L-citrulline, among others. In this review of berberine research, it was pointed out that berberine might raise the toxicity of a variety of medications, including warfarin, which is a blood thinner medication, as well as barbiturates and other diabetes medications. And it might also raise levels of a medication called cyclosporin, which is used by people who've had organ transplants. Until we know more, it might not be wise to combine berberine with CBD, also known as cannabidiol, because there may be an interaction. In one report, a woman who is taking berberine and hemp oil developed a condition called long QT syndrome, which can result in arrhythmias or alterations in how well the heart beats, low blood pressure, and even fainting. Now, when I looked into this report, she was taking 250 milligrams of berberine and up to six times the recommended amount of hemp oil. So is this really a true interaction of berberine and hemp oil, or is it rather something that may arise when someone takes more than the recommended amount of hemp oil? However, looking at the landscape from above, it does appear that berberine appears to be safe for most healthy people. However, I will point out if you are taking medications or you have any special health problems, it's wise to talk to your doctor and pharmacist for the best advice for you. And I'll also drop some links below on other videos I've done related to supplement side effects that can give you more insights on this. If you've had any side effects of berberine, drop a comment below and let me know what happened.